Hey guys, welcome to our What to Pack on your holiday with a newborn video. I will be your camera woman today and Mirte will be your lovely host. All the items that I will show you fit in these two suitcases. I will show you what we packed, I will show you what we packed for Julian and I will show you some other things that we packed that are very handy to have with you when you travel with a newborn. Um, so First of all, we packed one vest that is very warm, a sweater that is medium warm and we have a long sleeve t-shirt. Normal t-shirts, we packed three of them, so these are t-shirts slash loose tops. And we have three tops that are that fit tight to your body so that you can put them under your sweater or vest or t-shirt when you want to have more layers for when it's cold. So then we have shorts, leggings and jeans and some underwear. We usually pack underwear for half of the week because we do a laundry in the middle of our holiday. Two pairs of socks and then we get to the swimming department, we have a pareo because we never bring beach towels because they're big and they're heavy and these are very um, thin and light. We bring two bikinis each and a sport outfit that washes and dries easily, hat, sunglasses, shoes for sports, flip flops and we brought these for Greece to put them on on the beach and in the sea a play suit and a dress and that was it for the clothes so with these clothes you can dress for every weather um, between 15 and 30 degrees shower gel shampoo which i usually put in these travel things um, razor blades makeup tissues toothbrush toothpaste deodorant cream Day cream, Burt's Bees, which is good for everything, you guys. And no, this video is not sponsored by Burt's Bees. <laughs> this is the shit. Lenses and fluids, sunscreen, very important. Hair bands, cotton buds, tweezers, nail clippers. This is the most handy thing ever because you can put perfume in this and it's very lightweight mascara and a hairbrush this is what we packed for eight to ten days and uh, i will now show you guys what julian has we have one warm pajama one medium warm pajama and one summer pajama we packed two vests without sleeves two t-shirt vests and two vests with long sleeves then we have two shorts three pairs of socks because you always tend to lose one two t-shirts with long sleeves and a warm sweater one t-shirt and one cute outfit then we packed two leggings that are not too warm not too cold one legging with little feet for the cold nights and two bibs, pacifiers, some music thing, a little book for him. <laughs> what do you have to say about it? We packed four swaddles, two blankets, one warm one and one medium warm one and a washing glove that you can put on under the shower where you can hold him and he doesn't slip from your hand which is very handy. Um, shampoo and wash gel for babies. Sunscreen, very important. One big, huge swaddle, which is ideal because you can bring it everywhere. You can bring it to the beach, you can bring it with your stroller so that you can cover him from the sun. Diapers for a whole week, so even that was in our luggage where we didn't really need it, but we wanted to bring it. Cream for the little bum, diaper bags, wipes, and three swim diapers. His food for a whole week, 
packed a hot water bottle so we can feed him everywhere. We packed a bottle for the cold water and we packed two bottles for Julian. We always have this little diaper bag that we bring with us when we go out. So there are diapers in there, little wipes, diaper bags and a pacifier. And So this is what we use as a diaper bag. We don't have a backpack, we just bring this little one. So I guess that is what we bring for Julian. Okay, and so these are the other things that we pack. Um, things that are nice to have with you on a travel and usually lightweight. We always pack a handbag. A backpack that is very lightweight and that you can hold very small easily um, for groceries, to bring to the beach, you name it. Then I also bring this little bag as an extra to fit groceries in. It's also very lightweight and comes in very handy when you travel. Um, we always bring our licorice. This big beach towel comes from Brazil and it folds four times bigger than this. And we bring it on our trips where we go to the beach. We bring an umbrella for the sun or the rain. Um, we always have a scarf with us because it's nice to have in a plane and it's just cozy. Um, we have a sling for the baby or a baby carrier uh, for Julian. Um, our electronics, so camera, laptop, iPad and e-reader. Um, these hooks we always have tied to our bags. Um, we can put our flip-flops on them, we can, you can use them for everything. We always bring some coffee, um, small sunscreen for your handbags, earplugs, Ziploc bags, you can use them for anything. You can use them for dirty clothes when you are on the go with the baby, you can use them um, to store food in, you can use them to separate your socks from your underwear, you can use them for practically anything. So we bring a lot of those. And we have this little container for Julian's milk. And you can use it with one hand, which is nice in the plane when you have to pour food for Julian. So last but not least, I have five more tips for you when you travel with a newborn to a hotel. One is Julian sleeps in his pram. That means that he is in there day and night, but a newborn doesn't know the difference. So most hotels have baby beds, but if they don't and you don't want to put your baby in the pram, then you can buy these lightweight tents. They're available on the internet everywhere. Two, always ask if there is a water boiler in your room. If you are not breastfeeding. If you are bottom feeding, you need a water boiler to boil the water, especially in countries where you cannot drink water from the tap. Three, you can use the sink in the bathroom to bathe your baby in. Simply put a towel in there and makes it very comfortable for your baby. Four, is make a changing station out of a little table or a dresser in your hotel room. You can use one of the blankets that you brought with you. Five, if you don't have blankets, then use hotel towels to change your baby on. So this was our video on traveling with a newborn and what to bring, what to pack. We hope you liked this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos and um, give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Bye. Uh, bye. Say bye. Bye.